My name is Yemi Pet, and I best describe myself as an engineer by profession and an entrepreneur by passion. You see, I had an incident at childhood that I guess some could say was traumatic. And what it did was it robbed me of my voice. It robbed me of speaking how I felt. It would actually stop me being my best self in my career. Now, I guess the biggest thing for me that triggered me to want to make a change was actually stopping. Stopping long enough to be comfortable with being uncomfortable. It was me questioning how this event or other parts of my life had stopped me from living out my fullest potential. Like, let's be real, we talk about diversity. Diversity is not just about the skin tone or the gender. It's about what you bring. Like, everybody has their own superpower. Knowledge is power, but even more powerful when we execute it, and we execute it for good. The question I get asked every single time is, Yemi, how do you do it? The truth is that it didn't all start that way. I literally changed the way I was living my life over the past four years. Like, I always have to go back to a place of gratitude. No matter what's going wrong or right, I always remain grateful and humble to be able to serve people, because ultimately people have done the same for me. They say the antidote to fear is action. I am obsessed about working with organizations and people to be the best version of themselves. One of my whys, one of the reasons why I do what I do, is I truly want to arm people with education. And I'm not talking about traditional education. I'm talking about the education that is mixed with academics, but also the internal education about who we are. I truly believe that our dreams choose us. We usually think we choose it. If it's coming to your mind, it's because you are the person to do it. So go do it.